Hey. I went first. You go first. I was supposed to go first. Do you first. go first? All right, do it again. Hey, guys. Hey, guys. We're the Dorkeries. <laughs> We're the Dorkeries. So we have been doing a lot of online shopping, and we're like, what are we doing? This is it's a little... It's not as fun. It's not as fun. I mean, we don't have to go everywhere, but let's go to a couple places and just look for some dorky items uh, for our family. Because it's Christmas. So we're going to go see what we could find that's dorky and thought, let's take everybody else alongside with us so you can find out what it's like to shop along with the dorkeries. And well, what is it like to do Christmas with the dorkeries? What is it like to be a child mm. in a household of dorky parents? <laughs> so my main goal today is to find stocking stuffers okay. for our two teenage kids okay. who are extremely dorky, whether they want to admit it or not. They like all the same things that we like and sometimes more. Yep. Um, anything comic, anything anime, anything Marvel, anything... Disney. Disney. They just love it. So we are kicking off at BAM! 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 What's a million? BAM! Or uh, maybe up north, I think it's uh, second in Charles. So. Is it? I didn't know yeah. that. Yeah. All right. Well, I hope you have fun. Let's Yay! have fun! So East Tennessee's own Dolly Parton. Dolly Parton. If you've ever wondered, She's what are like the... What are the people like that live around the Dorkeries? They're all like Dolly Parton. She's like the queen of our hood. Okay, what about this? Um, what about this? Do we want to um, learn about Quidditch? Are you trying to hide that from me? Ages. Quidditch through the ages. Quidditch through the ages. I, I, she can't, she, I didn't even know that was out. I didn't know this was out. I'm not going to get you that for Christmas now. You just have to get it now. Guys, Ready Player One is my favorite book that I have ever read. And I've read every Harry Potter, so that's a very strong statement. Oh my god, true. Am I just buying it for myself? I don't... I mean, I think now... You're not buying it for me for Christmas? Oh my god. No, that should not come out of my budget for you. Can we get a basket? Do you want a... I would love an autograph copy. Is that a possibility? Sure, you look really cute with your basket. Thank you. I've never seen anybody with a basket in a bookstore. All right, Tara. If you had to choose just one, Marvel's 100 Greatest Comics or DC's 350 Greatest, okay? You get the, you get yes. whatever yeah. is those 100 or whatever is those 350. I get the actual comics. You get the actual comics. I'm going with DC. Wow. Just because it's more? Yeah. Don't you think the more value... Well, I don't know. They just sold the first appearance of Batman for one4 well, I was going million. for... If I get those, I was thinking I would probably get the first appearance of Batman and Superman. So you would be able to sell those? I would sell those and then <laughs> and then buy all of those. So that right those. there. <laughs> So you, that's what she chose. That's pretty, that's pretty wise. It's like, yeah. sell these. Yeah, buy those. And have <laughs> money left over. That's smart. I smell what you're cooking. Yeah, no. <laughs> that's great. <laughs> no, wrestling isn't gross. I didn't say wrestling was gross. I don't know why I said that. <laughs> I never said that. Nobody that's my said boy that right I said there. that. Hulkamania, baby. I never said that. There's, there's mine. We've been watching a lot of Crown. <laughs> don't don't judge. Don't thumbs down us. What did you find? Thunder myth with the people, people, purple people. That's awesome. People, paper, people. That's good. Put it in. Put it in. Put it in. Put it in. Ooh. All right. If you're that's neat. If you're watching this and you haven't watched <gasps> episode five, we have a name. We have a name. Vera? Grogu. No. Grogu. Grogu? Yeah. Huh? Grogu. Huh? And he says, huh? Every huh? time you say his name, just like my cat. Grogu. Ooh. That's a good little stocking stuffer for Pepe. Are they? Oh, they're bag clips. Yeah. I don't like the bag clips. 
That's what all of these are. They're plastic. Oh, you I, like I the like keychains. Key I don't like the plastic. Well, maybe they don't have keychains. Well, maybe then we won't buy that. <laughs> I do like that a whole lot. That's amazing. Coffee is strong. The coffee is strong. Oh, is this gonna be Grogu? That's cute. <laughs> that's so cute. Here's the problem with all of this merch though. His little cradle has been destroyed. It's not in the show but anymore. you know they're gonna make him a new one. Did you see this? This is cool. So that way you know who's, it's like, I never know what wands or what wand in oh, is, Harry Potter. That is very cool. So this is the lightsabers for. That is actually really helpful. Especially like when you go to, when you go to Galaxy's Edge. Yeah. And you, you, you like already know you don't have to ask and then, and then like, you look i don't need your help I you know look more like I'm a dork for. and but you're a respected but you would dork. never talk to people that way right <laughs> already got all those for pay got those on sale for black friday hey our kids might watch this oh no they won't <laughs> <laughs> a little herb universe action i love her universe we love ashley that's not her universe no. is it no you just making up things? I am. I feel like our universe is exclusive to Hot Topic now, isn't it? Uh, maybe. Because they bought it. They paid for it. You know, like, if he did give up Groku, Groku, Groku. Groku. Like, what would happen to all this stuff? Like, what would happen to the Mandalorian? I feel like it'd be over. I'm sure they would come up with something else super, super fun. You ever notice? That one's cool. You ever notice with this backpack that when you have Wicket like this, Wicket looks like a dog? Right? Mm -hmm. But if you fix his ears the way they're supposed to, oh. now it looks like Wicket. So no, that so dog. they're just not. But the only way, the only way to fix that is to put too much stuff in your purse, and yeah. then it's heavy. See, right now it just looks like a little dog. Yeah, I don't like that. So you got. I don't it. like this That's, design. Yeah. Don't buy that for me, Drew. I won't. Oh my gosh, look at this. What is it? Oh, that's cool. <laughs> I wish, I wish Lego would pick this up. Mm -hmm. So these are the people that are stopping us from having the office Legos. Do you know what, what um, licensing even... has taken place though that's really cool? What's that? Uh, the office and little people. Are you serious? Yeah, there's office little people. That's awesome. That's awesome. Mm -hmm. So, I think it's cool that they really sell this, <laughs> but I don't want it unless it's the nude version that, <laughs> that Michael kept for himself. I have asked Santa for these, so I'm hoping, hoping Santa comes through. Have you been a good boy? Uh, no. But uh, if I get those, then I have the entire collection. I'm not missing one. This is cool. Oh, gosh. Vance? Bob Vance. Bob Vance. Vance, Vance refrigeration. refrigeration. And what do Bob you do? Vance. Vance refrigeration. This is our pop inventory at our BAM. So they're pretty well stocked. Are Vance. they stocked with things that we need though? Uh, no. Not unless, I know you've been really wanting. <laughs> Put it back. Put it back. That's cool. Young hey, uh, Squidward. Shout out to Mr. Gretzky. He would like this. Archie Betty Cooper. That's cool. I don't know. I was looking for it, but I don't know. Uh, I, was looking, I was looking at Scuba Sam. But this one? I like that one. That's cool. Mr. Gretzky would like that. Ooh. Mad Men? Mad Men. One of our faves. What else am I going to? <laughs> Uh, there's Dr. Who down there, but I've already got this. Oh, Drew, that's so cool, Zotar. Yeah. <laughs> so, our band used to do comics, but for some reason they stopped. And this you think is too many were getting damaged? Probably. I mean, they had, they had, as far as you could see down there, mm -hmm. they had comics. As far but as you can see, yeah. They're gone. This is all we got. 
This is cool though, because this would match the Marvel character encyclopedia, but it's weird because think about the Marvel ones like that big. Mm, we have some Marvel ones oh, that wait, are that size. That's just Batman. We have some Marvel ones that are that size. This is just Batman though. That makes me feel a little bit better. I, th I was thinking it was all It was DC. everything. I understand what you're saying. All right, you have to pick one thing off of just this shelf. What are you picking? Off of this shelf? Yep, just this shelf. What are you picking? Uh, I'm really into just more Star Wars right now. Ooh, this is cool. Oh, wow, that's so cute. That's I had that comic when I was a kid. That's the Ewoks number one. That's fun. I like that. Look at that. That's a good price for that, too. How fun is that? I'd read that all day long. That's very cute. That's a good stocking stuffer. I agree. I want to know a little bit more about her. What's her name? America Chavez. So. Okay, but you have to choose between that one and the Ewoks. Uh, you still going with the Ewoks? I probably need to know more about America Chavez than I do about Ewoks. Mm. So. That's then a good you price. lied the first time. Six dollars. Wow. <laughs> just kidding. You changed your mind. I'm just kidding. Don't be mad. Oh, I'm not mad. I would gladly take that. Yeah. Okay, Drew. We came here for our kids. Oh, yeah. <laughs> okay. So, our son's been... He put this on his list. And I'm like, it's pretty cool, but... It just seems very weird that my son wants an action figure of a serial killer. <laughs> why? Well, we just let him watch Scream we at did. Halloween for the first time. We but did. I still don't understand why he would want... The action figure. I don't know. It's pretty cool, though. Does anybody else know why he wants it's it? It's NECA. I don't know. We're not getting it. <laughs> so, okay. Like, if you're a horror collector, like, you have all these on your shelf. Like, we've even got, like, a... We've got an Alex Ross print. That would look really cool framed autographed, with this. Autographed, Yeah, autographed by Alex Ross. So, Low Grade Hero, his yeah. um, wife. Oh, yeah. Jess. I yeah, think yeah, her name yeah, is yeah. Jess. Yeah. She does, like, she's... Her whole Instagram is horror stuff. Yeah, that's cool. Look at the detail on his face. Yeah, that's pretty cool. I mean, that's a $40 figure, so that's, that's for that kind of detail. Serious? That's not bad. What is this? Uh, those are Funko figures. But let me show you this. My son also wants this, which I'm a little better with this. That's cool. That is very cool. I'm trying to get, there's a lot of glare, but like, I really, I just like how much it looks like the movie. This is so heavy. Drew, that is not a this stocking stuffer. This is so stuffer. heavy. This is on clearance. How much do you think this is? Uh, $10. No, good Lord. It's no. on clearance. It's $40, but it is the Uncanny X-Men 256, 258, 268, 269, 274 through 277. So basically, it's all Jim Lee stuff. Is it... Forty dollars before the thirty percent off. Uh, normally it is a hundred dollars, wow. so it's forty dollars before the thirty percent off. It's like the same length as your whole torso I know. area. It is so heavy. Up your your whole upper body. Ooh, get it! Ooh, get it! Look at that right there. Everybody likes that right there. Now squat. Do some squats. You do a squ and then push up, all the way up. Now squat. <sighs> Squat, and then you push it up when you get up. You push, yeah, Wait, just like that. you can see my belly. No, you go down, and then you push uh, up. Good job. Make me an offer I can't refuse. I know exactly what offer. <laughs> we never refuse. So here's one of my favorite sections. Our local books a million. They're legends. I like it better when they put them on clearance, but they've got a pretty good selection. So look, there's your girl. Dazzler. I think considering Target usually only has like three in stock. Yeah. This is. That's pretty good. Pretty and some amazing. older ones too. Even even Walgreens usually only has two different figures. Yeah. So this is good. But not too long ago, I got the uh, Venom build a figure wave for like thirty bucks for all of them. It was crazy. They were all like just a couple of bucks a piece. So every now and again, you can get some really good deals. Uh, my son really wants that one. I mm -hmm. think it's pretty cool because you can swap. Here, I'll show you. You can swap the heads of the old X-Men franchise. So you got Patrick Stewart. And so oh you could. Oh my 
with you can swap them with McAvoy. So you can either have Patrick Stewart or McAvoy's interpretation, and then That's Fassbender cool. and Gandalf. What was his name? Sir Ian. No. Yes. yes. I don't know. Yeah. So. Um. That's creepy, but. Isn't that cool? Uh, it's kind of like the Spider-Man where you can swap Mary Jane's head. Yeah, um, with Gwen Stacy. But that's very cool. Yeah. Ooh. Yeah. Have you ever seen these before? No. Cool. So you learn like more about Beast Boy? Is that? Oh, that's cool. It's just a graphic novel about Beast Boy. Is it? Okay, I want to see the inside. Is it anime? Yeah, so it's anime oh, style. That's so cool. That's very cool. Surely they have them about all, all the Teen Titans, you think? Yeah, probably. Yeah. Very cool. We are done at BAM. Yeah, first stop was a success. Was it? Because we came out with no stocking stuffers. Oh. How can you call this a success? Well, that was my one my one goal today was stocking stuffers, and I got this. Yes. And you got? Uh, yeah, the office mug. The office mug. That's okay. The only thing we got for our kids is we found this for a dollar. Which was more like 80 cents. It was 80 discount? cents because we get a discount. Right. Um, so we got this for 80 cents, which is cute because we're going to, uh, our son has a Marvel Christmas tree in his bedroom. So going to prop this up right next to it. It's and then we got cute. this again, because I don't care what the pop is. It, you know, Woody Harrelson's great in this movie. I love Solo, but I don't care what the pop is. If you get it for 80 cents, you get it. It's because it's worth more than that. So anyways, well, we're going to find some more stocking stuffers. Oh, wait. So. We're next stop. Next up is our LCS who's doing some Black Friday sales. So of course we're gonna support our LCS Black Friday sales. There might may even be stuff that we don't need, but by golly, we love Snake Eyes and we love Jonathan. We're gonna buy something. And I'm also probably not gonna come out with any stocking stuffers and no. maybe nothing for our kids. Probably something that we can open up right now. Mm, <laughs> let's go. Hey guys, this is Jonathan. Jonathan, say hi. Hello. We talk about Jonathan all the time. Jonathan owns our LCS Snake Eyes comics. Yep. He's our favorite. His yep. store is our favorite. Knoxville, Tennessee. And we Snake are Eyes hitting comics. up Black Friday sales at Snake Eyes. What do you have going on for us today? Uh, so everything in the store is on sale today. Big deals are buy two, get one free on back issues. Buy three, get one free on trades and new issues. And the dollar for comics as well. So we're gonna dig? Yes, all day. <laughs> you like digging all day? All day. <laughs> Just dig, dig, dig. All right, uh, did you sell the, no, you didn't. I wanna see, I wanna see, I wanna see. Nope, nope, all the way left, yes. Yes. What's this? This is the second appearance of Green Goblin, but the first appearance where he's not on a broomstick. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> and he's on his glider. Probably first glider, isn't it? Yeah, it is. I actually like this one also better because it's got that amazing torch. Like, I don't know quite what he's doing. Look at the torch's face. Hey, look, is he enjoying that webbing a little too much? <laughs> <laughs> that front page goodness. I look how it says robustly drawn by Steve. Are you ready to go, sir? I don't know what else I'm looking for. Like, That's I a really good one. I'm all over the place. Yeah. There's all this. This is awesome. Don't go to the office. So I'm wondering if new boxes of these okay. will now say Grogu. Ah. What do you think? Maybe. They'll have to wait a little while because it takes forever for people to watch it so they don't get spoiled. True. Look. Social levels are treated differently. Oh, that'd be a good stocking stepper. Drew, we found one. It's taken us all day. And two stores. <laughs> we found a stocking stepper. Just one? Just one. Okay. Yeah. They don't know what they're going to do. Is it? Mm. Pick it up and see if it has a price on it. 
Nope. My guess is 1999 because everything else wrong. important thing and it's always fun to do this and when people are walking by and there's a grown man sitting there doing this toys and they're like <laughs> this is the only way that you know like I've got that figure so like like for instance if I wanted moaning myrtle then I would try to feel for her book you like feeling books <laughs> or if I wanted uh, Bellatrix, try to find the handcuffs. Yeah, but the hard thing is sometimes you can confuse that brick for Mooney Myrtle's book. And they're all holding a wand. And also, Harry also has a book in his hand. So, like. so here's where our little 80 cent baby Groot ended up with our sons. Marvel Christmas tree. He's got, let's see, he's got a big root, Black Panther, Captain America, Spider Man. Oh, I saw, did I see a different Spider Man somewhere? I thought I saw another Spider Man. There is another Captain America, another hanging Spider Man. Iron Man, there's another Groot. I feel like there's something else on here I'm missing. But, I don't know, but that's it. And that's where this cute little guy, I don't know if you can see, that is a Groot Guardians of the Galaxy scarf as his tree skirt. But how cute, baby Groot. Merry Christmas, baby Groot. And then while we're at it, this is our daughter's tree on her dresser. It's Harry Potter themed, so we've got a little Hedwig. A little robe just dorking it up all over the place everywhere we can it's a very merry dorkery Christmas in this house. several places yeah um, and I think we got three socking stuffers yeah <laughs> But we bought a lot of things for ourselves. That's right. That's the most important thing. <laughs> and we looked at a lot of dorky stuff, which is yes. basically the joy of being a dork. Yes. Anyways, so show them a couple of things that we um, didn't have the camera on when we were buying. Well, I think you put it on this, but I grabbed the whole box because <laughs> <laughs> my son likes his stores. And I'm not, I'm trying to whisper so I just because they're hilarious. But they don't watch our videos, so. <laughs> There's not gonna be spoilers. He likes that, but obviously it's got those. It's, look, look at, look at, look at, look at, look at all those goodies that you can get. Look at, look at that Bellatrix right there. Bellatrix. Look at them. Helena. See, I feel for these things. I feel for like those little beanies and that little baby. Did you see beans? Whoa, beans! So there's that. What did you get from the comic book store? Um, I got a project for Erod two one two. That's right. But let's make this who can love Erod the most yeah. competition. Yeah. But uh, anyways, give him some love. So this this has got a lot of things going love on with it. This is you. kind of a hot book, Lee Dorkery, and it's Busy. it's a new stand, uh, but it needs a lot of you tender make love. Comic it needs a lot. I don't know if you can see it, but it's it's it needs a lot of love. But it's an entry point, and I didn't pay a lot for this. So aren't you glad I didn't do the high part? Uh oh, I may have just hurt some YouTube speakers there. So what do you think? You, you said something you know, about this being a really cool comic, and I was just yeah, because it's like and... all the nostalgia of the '80s, and then you know I used to collect GI Joes. I had a lot of them, so this is the first GI Joe issue. So you see, it's got a little way, it's got a little, you know, and he's clean right there. It's got some spine ticks, but, you know, it's an entry point. It's an entry point, Lady So who Lady was Dorothy. this a Christmas present for? Me. 
You buy presents for yourself? No. That's just, listen, it's like a month until Christmas. You can't go a whole month without buying something. Can it's you? true. You cannot go a oh, whole that's, hour. That's it. Oh, oh, I did get you this. I got you. <laughs> I got you this for Christmas. Ow. You almost hit me in the face. I got you this. I got you this for Christmas. Merry Christmas, Lady. <laughs> this is not working. Oh, well. Nope. It, it doesn't come out that easy. So. Oh, gosh. Quit trying to beat size, me with Grogu. A life-size Grogu. So, but we're, we're not keeping this. We're not. If you want it, let us know. Yeah. <laughs> you want it? Maybe, maybe, we'll, maybe we'll do a giveaway. <laughs> no, we won't. No, we're going to get it. Let's get it. True. It's not coming out. All right. You, you keep saying what you do for... for I'm going to get it. You keep going. Keep oh, going. I don't have anything. <laughs> yeah, say what you do about the stocking stuffers. I don't... I don't... Stocking stuffers. I have no idea what we're talking about. We don't have enough. If you have any ideas, let us know. <laughs> We what need, do you do for your stocking stuffers? We need more stocking stuffers. Yeah, it's not coming Do out. you mean what do I want for stocking stuffers? Yeah. Mm, I'd like some more Thrawn books. Oh, oh okay. Um, I would like... I don't know which ones you have. I don't have a library downstairs. Um, and um, I like jewelry. Okay. Um, I'm not going to say anything else because okay. if it's not on your list, then you're going to be like, crap, I, I got to go buy it now. Oh, I got, I've got this. What do you think about that? You can buy that today. You got to do our today haul. Now oh. you're just pulling stuff out okay. of your butt. Well, I just got that a couple days ago. All right, Drew. All right. It's been a long day. Thanks for yeah. shopping with us. Thanks for hanging out with us. Um, this was not a comic haul. I hope you're okay with that. But Christmas, we think, is about family. And those of you who have befriended us, we consider you part of our family. So thanks for having a dorky shopping spree with us today and helping us pick out Christmas presents for our children and ourselves. In the meantime, go dork yourself. Go dork yourself! <laughs> dork you, Drew.